The vitality of research on the University of Michigan campus is truly amazing. Our faculty are engaged in pathbreaking work on everything from the dynamics of diseases in aquatic environments to the role of public art in ancient Rome. The Arthur F. Thurnau professorships recognize faculty members who excel in sharing the excitement of intellectual engagement with their students. Arthur F. Thurnau attended the University of Michigan from 1902 to 1904, and he wished to return to the university, something of the value he gained from being an undergraduate on this campus. In that spirit and in his memory, the Thurnau professorships are awarded annually to recognize faculty who have made outstanding contributions to undergraduate education. In the next few minutes, you will have a chance to learn about and hear from some of the extraordinary faculty members who have been honored with Thurnau professorships. Their commitment to undergraduate education sets the standard for our campus. Making a difference has always been important to Professor Gutierrez, who is active in community involvement in her research and in her teaching. I actually engage students in a lot of the research I do, uh, so they're getting sort of one-on-one -on -one or lab group kind of education as well as the classroom teaching that I do. Professor Gutierrez loves the energy and inquisitiveness her students bring to their classes. In her mentoring and teaching, she helps them hone their skills as creative, critical thinkers and expand their vision of what it means to be engaged citizens in a diverse democracy. What we do and learn about in colleges and universities is very relevant and applicable to the rest of society. So I'm hoping they'll take those things that they learned, those skills that they learned, and also how people in society are interconnected, how we can all play a role in making sort of the world a better place. Frida Herseth's students have performed spectrographs and examined the vocal tracts on human cadavers. That would be common if this was Anatomy 101, but Herseth teaches one-on-one -on -one studio voice lessons and voice pedagogy, a course about the structure and function of the singing voice. I have the privilege and honor and responsibility of working with masterpieces and helping students understand in their way what these works are about. So finding their voice through these amazing pieces. Herseth is deeply committed to her students' artistic and personal growth. As she prepares the next generation of singers to begin their careers, she wants them to understand the importance of the connection between mind, body, and spirit in music making. The students who take Professor Alexander's class not only graduate, they emerge as passionate and hopeful visionaries who constantly think outside the box to discover ways they can make a change. Students in Professor Buzz Alexander's English 319 course experience firsthand the issues surrounding incarceration in America and how reaching out to the men and women in Michigan's prisons can be a rewarding and challenging experience. It has a considerable impact on their thinking about the society they live in, uh, their own responsibilities, and it very much influences people's careers. Through these workshops, prisoners have a creative outlet to tell their stories. We're uh, very uh, invested in prisoners having a chance to grow that most of them didn't have because of the environments they grew up in, and now this is their chance. For his outstanding accomplishments educating U of M students, Professor Alexander was selected as a U.S. Professor of the Year in 2005, the major national teaching award for the best college teacher. Sometimes what students learn at the University of Michigan really is rocket science. Professor Alec Gallimore teaches his students the latest concepts and technologies in deep space mission planning, and then assigns them to develop and present group projects in response to actual NASA mission requests. It was just wonderful to see the students actually be able to really challenge the NASA engineers and know the shortfalls of their design, and to hear the NASA engineer go, well, right now our design is this, but we'll probably switch to what you guys did. Professor Gallimore uses a variety of teaching methods to respond to the diversity of learning styles he sees in his classes. 
students arrive in my classroom from very different backgrounds and different plights, and so I try to um, diversify the way I approach my teaching so that I reach as many students. Professor Gallimore says his primary legacy is shown in his many undergraduate students who have worked in his lab and gone on to important jobs and internships in the aerospace industry. They all say, wow, that was an amazing course. It really is like that in the real world. And I feel so much better prepared to go work on an actual, you know, space mission because I've gone through that course. And so that's, you know, that's our job, frankly, is to prepare them for the real world. So it makes me feel good. Learning does not end in the classroom for Professor Timothy McKay's students. If they have the desire, he has the opportunity just for them. Professor McKay encourages students to get involved in research as undergrads, and he is quick to support a student who shows the desire to learn. Most students think they have to have a vast array of skills before they can get involved in research. The fact is, any research project they get involved with is going to require them to learn a lot of new skills. As long as they're smart, willing, able to work hard, they uh, will do very well in research. McKay's teaching methods encourage students to challenge themselves to find the right answer. It's not just the subject matter of the courses that the faculty are here to provide. They're here to provide a lifetime of experience As part of the University of Michigan's teacher education program, Professor Elizabeth Moji works to prepare the teachers of tomorrow. We want to prepare the very best possible teachers that we can, um, and we really want to make sure that as they go out into the world, they're equipped with at least the, the knowledge that beginning teachers need to enhance the educational opportunities for all kids. She takes a holistic approach to teaching and learning, encouraging students to integrate theory, research, and practical skills. One of my major goals is the development of a professional identity. Moving from a student identity to, I, am, I now need to think like a teacher. Her attention to service and mentorship demonstrates a powerful investment in her students. Professor Moji is an excellent teacher, researcher, mentor, and wonderful person. She's the kind of professor a young student needs early on in their educational career. Dedicated, passionate, innovative, and completely committed to providing an inspiring undergraduate education. The University of Michigan Thurnau Professors.